DTE has crews from different states descending on Metro Detroit and working with local crews to restore power. Yeah, and all of the coordinating is happening right in here, right inside the center right there. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester got access inside DTE's command center to find out what happens after the storm hits. We're here right now inside the DTE command center in the heart of downtown Detroit. Take a look over my shoulder. You can see all the information out here right now. This is a live look at the areas that are still without power, and you can see the teams here working to get information from crews on the ground to restore power within your neighborhood as soon as possible. Right now, there are about 150,000 people still dealing with power outages. There are 3,000 utility workers right now working on this and of that about a thousand coming from other states like New York, Wisconsin, and Ohio. Crews are working 24-7 to restore power in your neighborhood. They hope to have everybody powered up by Friday. If that doesn't happen for you, make sure that you reach out to DTE. The best way to do so, using the DTE app. And of course, if you have problems, I want to hear directly from you. We've got all the information that you can work to contact Help Me Hank and our team right at clickondetroit.com. That is the latest information here from DTE. We're in downtown Detroit. Hank Winchester, Help Me Hank. Back to you. All right, ahead at six, Helmy Hank is in southwest Detroit with folks dealing without power right now. He got an update on when they and others may see their power restored.